lot of people eat in Phuket. So currently it's 31 degrees Celsius in Phuket, so it's very, very hot. And it's also monsoon season here in Phuket, or in Thailand. So it rains mostly every night. And the food in Phuket was completely different. So we've had chicken feet, grasshoppers, crickets, all sorts of different foods. We've been eating noodles and just having a really good time enjoying the different cultures here in Phuket. Someone asked us how we're gonna spend our days off. I think at the start we'll probably start exploring. We'll probably do a lot of diving on our days off as well. The most beautiful part of Phuket, I think, so far for me, has been Phi Phi Island. These gorgeous big white islands with jungle on the top. And you see lots of sharks and lots of beautiful things. And it's just a, it's a gorgeous place. Guys asked if uh, you could cook and eat a box jellyfish. So we haven't seen anyone doing that. But we looked into it and you could actually do it. But because like the way they cook it, it gets rid of all the stinging cells. So you could possibly eat it, but it just wouldn't taste very nice. One of you asked us if we expect to encounter coral bleaching and if we can reverse it. So, so far we haven't been on that many dives and we haven't come across any. What we have seen a lot of though is trampling, which is when people, snorkelers, tourists, swimmers, they trample on a lot of the coral and they destroy it, bits break off and it dies, probably because of the amount of tourists. Um, and we've seen a lot of that around here. So, you guys asked us what is the biggest animal that we've seen. It was this huge moray eel, like this thick, like it has was like this big. But it was just chilling down there, like a huge, like two meter long eel. It was amazing. The largest animal that I've seen, seeing a whale shark, which is the largest species of shark in the world. And it can measure up to about 12 meters long. So it's very lucky to have that experience. Someone asked, is there a lot of plastic pollution in Phuket? And yes, there is. We're seeing a lot of plastic whenever we go to the beach. And someone also asked, do you think that people in Thailand are aware of plastic pollution? And we think they're not very aware because as you go to the supermarket, in any of the market, everything is wrapped in disposable plastic and not many people are using reusable plastic bags or carriers. So someone asked, why did we want to study marine biology? And my reason is, I think the oceans are the most important ecosystems on our planet. They've got the coolest animals, they're the biggest, and they're also the ones in the most danger. So I really want to be part of the people that make a change to help the oceans in the future. Someone asked, why do you want to scuba dive? So I just wanted to try something different. It's something I've always wanted to do. I enjoy swimming, I enjoy snorkeling, and underwater is a whole different world out there.